Morning, everyone. Morning. 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 Let me see. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. It's time to get back to work, and there is plenty of work to do. You know, the members of our majority understand how important it is to avert the fiscal cliff. I'm open to compromise. I'm open to new ideas. I'm committed to solving our fiscal challenges. And I'm proposing that we avert the fiscal cliff uh, together in a manner that ensures that 2013 is finally the year uh, that our government comes to grips with the major problems that are facing us. What the American people are looking for is cooperation. They're looking for consensus. They're looking for common sense. Most of all, they want action. Everything on the revenue side and on the spending side has to be looked at. I was encouraged to hear Speaker Boehner agree that tax revenue has to be part of this equation. Everyone wants to get our economy moving again. Everyone wants to get more Americans back to work again. Nobody, not Republicans, not Democrats, want taxes to go up for folks making under $250,000 a year. Well, when the President and I have been able to come to an agreement, there's been no problem in getting it passed uh, here in the House. I think we both understand uh, that uh, trying to find a way to avert uh, the fiscal cliff is important for our country, and I'm hopeful. Let's extend the middle class tax cuts right now. And I've got the pen ready to sign the bill right away. I'm ready to do it. I'm ready to do it. You know, on Wednesday, I outlined a responsible path forward uh, to avert of the fiscal cliff without raising tax rates. We can't just cut our way to prosperity. If we're serious about reducing the deficit, we have to combine spending cuts with revenue. Raising tax rates uh, will slow down our ability to create the jobs that everyone says they want. I refuse to accept any approach that isn't balanced. Uh, this is an opportunity for the president to lead. I'm not going to ask students and seniors and middle-class families to pay down the entire deficit while people like me making over $250,000 aren't asked to pay a dime more in taxes. I'm not going to do that. There's a Republican majority uh, here in the House. Uh, the American people re-elected the Republican majority. So our job now is to get a majority in Congress to reflect the will of the American people. 